For the first time since the day Adrian died, I was no longer certain of my own place at the top of the food chain. I knew then how my ancestors must have felt, struggling to survive in a hostile wilderness where the hunter is both predator and prey. I think that is literally said in every single level intro. With only fully automatic weapons and regenerating health to save me. <laughs> What's really great, I'm I don't know if it's this video or a later video. Oh, hold on. I can see you now. It is good to find you still among the living. You honor the spirits of your ancestors, and in return they offer you their protection. Otherwise, you would surely be dead by now. I can guide you to my position, but it won't be easy. First, you must pass through the tall grass before you. Listen to me, my friend. The grass hides many dangers, but it can hide you as well. You must keep your eyes and your wits sharp, or you will not survive, no matter how many spirits watch over you. That's fine. Oh, <laughs> that was a pretty lucky art shot. I know. Anyways, I don't know if it's this video that demonstrates it, or a later one, but I know I've recorded it. When you hold down the button to suck up skulls from a distance they when they hit Cole's body they don't instantly get picked up there's a short like one second window where they just get stuck against his body and kind of vibrate back and forth like they're trying to force their way into his body well that would have been really funny when it happened but now you ruined it well so funny I'm, when you get I'm to see it I'm not going to pay attention to a damn thing I'm just waiting for vibrating the skulls are you shooting birds now I couldn't give a shit whatever I just wish you could have third-person view, so you could see Cole covered in vibrating animal skull armor. Oh, that would be the best. Mm -hmm. And it's and it's okay if, you know, like a tiger or something, scratches out his eyes because he'll have those vibrating skulls for echolocation. I wonder what Hunter Vision would look like in a third-person version of Cabela's. Oh boy. It wouldn't actually change the screen, you'd just be able to zoom in on Cole's eyes and they're glazed over, <laughs> rolled in the back of his head. <laughs> he starts drooling. <laughs> oh, you can get two horns, that's a lot of points. Yeah. Except you can't. Bullshit. Oh, I'm not. <laughs> I'm not gonna take the effort to take those horns off. If I can't shoot them off. If you go near those, will they try to hurt you? No. You they'll murderer! They'll just run away. That's all they do. They just go, ugh, and run away. Tell me where Mbeki is. Tell me! Where's Mbeki? Oh, but gotta be quiet for these cutscenes. Yep. Gotta. No heart shot? What is this? Heart shot and headshot it just kind of happens randomly. There's so many times where I feel like I'm shooting like their foot, and I'll get a heart shot. And I'm very glad that these animals never like actually sink their teeth into you or do anything to pin you down. They just, you know, scratch your eyeballs a little, bounce off you. Oh, whoa, whoa. oh the eyeballs in the back of my head! No, <laughs> no, Simba. Go see Lion King in 3D for two weeks only. <laughs> that, that might be finished by the time this goes up. I don't know. I don't know. You won't like it if your light's camera Jackson, though. He hated the <laughs> hell out of it. He did? <laughs> yeah, he posted a review of Lion King 3D, and he said, The 3D wasn't great at all, and also, I don't get why people like the Lion King. C minus! <laughs> he gave it a C minus. Shithead. <laughs> that damn child, I'm gonna murder him! I didn't say that. <laughs> I know. I'm not Cole. <laughs> it's a subjective fight. Fine likes Camera Jackson. The greatest predator is the child critic. If you can <laughs> kill one of those, you're a real man, Cole. They're really good at just distracting you and stopping you in place by reviewing good movies and saying they're bad. God. 
Marmaduke the movie. C plus. Inception. <laughs> C minus. I'm actually, I'm actually using Hunter Vision correctly at the moment. Really? I, I just killed know. a snake. <laughs> and there are more snakes there, but you can't tell that there's a rock in way with Hunter Vision. Oh, oh. Well, you can't hunt rocks, so what's the point? Only God would give life to these lifeless objects. <laughs> then I could hunt everything. Oh. oh, I got one. There we go. It, it looks like you are out of ammunition. Nah. No? Oh, I saw a little icon pop up that say you couldn't <clears> use <throat> your shotgun or something. I don't know. Oh, no, it, it, it's the uh, icon for, no, your pistol doesn't have a scope. So stop oh. trying. <laughs> oh, come on, you don't even need to zoom in. You, you can just see it so plainly. Yeah. Hunter vision is all the aid you need. <laughs> Get away from that journal, you snake. Thank you, you there. And again, <laughs> vultures will get piss as hell at you in this area, and it... You should be doing that. Vultures should be worshipping you as their god. Thank you. I helped to bury another family this morning. The local villagers are on the verge of rioting. They say that if the government cannot protect them, then they will protect themselves. I fear what will happen if these beasts are not found soon. Oh no. How did it Umbe Why did Umbeki leave a journal there? <laughs> Oops, Umbeki just got butterfingers today. Good thing I have 12 journals with me. Oh, I thought it was like... Becky's teenage diary or something. He just <laughs> left years ago. That vulture just vanished. This is a this is a recent uprising we're being threatened with. I guess so. I I don't think those were thoughts he was musing about after the boat crashed on his way to wherever. I don't know. <laughs> after that hippo assault. <laughs> that tactical hippo assault. The hippos are getting smarter. Would a vulture eat a vulture? Are there any records of that? I don't know if vultures are, would... You know... Because I can think cannibals. of a few that are about to try. Mm -hmm. So I just love the sound Cole makes when he gets hurt. It's just... It just sounds like he's a little tired. Not, not pain, not <sighs> like, Oh! Oh, that's a beat going through my skin! No, it's just like, oh... <sighs> That's a beat. Shake it off. Walk, walk it off. Be a man. Yeah. Be a man, Cole. Those cans give you experience for some reason. Really? Yeah. Are, are they the beehives of Africa? Or... Mm -hmm. No, they, they don't count as collectibles. They're just cans that give you 50 experience points. Also, on the other side of this fence is a buffalo horn. The only way you can get it is by rubbing up against this, because there's an invisible wall right, in the, right over there. So you just have to rub up against the fence and hope that the pick up this buffalo horn prompt comes up. Also, a new gun. That's garbage. Crossbow. Today, I stopped the villagers from attacking a woman. They said the woman was a witch, and that she had summoned a dark creature called the Kaftar to prey upon them. I remember my grandfather speaking of the Kaftar when I was a child. I, I, you, normally, when you get a crossbow in a video game, it's like, hell yes, crossbow, but the crossbow in this game sucks. Well, yeah, I, I find that a bit more realistic. Mm -hmm. I can either have gunpowder or my own arm. Mm -hmm. What will I use to propel my projectile? Well, I, I mean, it's a crossbow, so you, you don't have to pull anything back. Okay, it's a like stick. A... Yes, a stick. Oh, no, there's two of them. <laughs> oh. Oh, whatever. I'm still waiting for this vibration. I don't know I don't know if it's this video. It just happens at some point. I'm, I'm feeling lonely. I, I need oh. something. 
<laughs> what, what was that noise? I'm getting out of here. What? The, what? Come here. So if the crossbow is so bad, why are you using it? I don't know. I used it a couple times and then never use it again, I think. For the benefit of the folks at home. Yes. It is imperative that you see this crossbow action and how terrible it is. I really need some skulls because I'm incredibly low in health. Gotta chew in some bones. <laughs> Put them in my body. Whew. Ah, instantly feel better. Not as as good as if I picked up a journal page, though. <laughs> That's... Mm, Becky, where are your notes? <laughs> <laughs> I don't care what you wrote in it. It, it can just Those... be any any diary entry. Milk, eggs, bread, pasta oh, sauce. Oh, yes. Whew, that's nice. Mm, Becky's to-do list for January 25th of 2007. Plus 50 health. <laughs> Terrible movie. <laughs> oh no. That's that's how they do it. The the lionesses do the hunting, mm -hmm. and the lions just stand there with distracting you with their majesty. <laughs> Look at that. Look at mane. that mane. Wow. Lion Buffalo never had a chance. Whoop. This is intense. Yeah, very intense, especially when it happens the second time in one level. <laughs> I I honestly forgot that there was a first time. <laughs> this game is so dull. Yeah, this is the last really super... The latter half of the game is, is the part that gets a little crazy. <laughs> not, not super insane, it's not... It gets dumb. Don't we get. Just, your... We just need more of Cole's family. That, yeah. That's what brings the fun. Basically, once other characters get involved, yeah, you can just farm experience points here forever. I'll have you know that our uh, herbivore migration is very important to the African ecology. <laughs> Don't care. Experience <laughs> points. Level up. If I were 12, I'd think that would be hilarious. Oh, you missed it, actually. What? It what? just happened. It, that's not the example, but it happened. That's one of many occurrences of vibrating skull shadow. All right, stop recording. I'm rewinding. <laughs> no, don't do that. Oh, man. All these guys. <laughs> yes. They're just staring at you. Yes. That was a gut shot. What the? <laughs> they have multiple given parts. Them for free. Yes. Their hearts are larger than most human beings. Mm -hmm. Not human hearts. The whole thing. The whole human being. <laughs> God gave them abnormally large hitboxes. Every one of them saved Christmas twice. <laughs> Thank you, RoboCop. You know how many heart sizes that is? <laughs> how dare these animals walk by me. <laughs> you shouldn't be so gleeful about this. I left two alive. We'll just hope that they're male and female. <laughs> this shall be our Eden. <laughs> Come to the watering hole. Oh wait, crocodile. Now they're extinct forever. <laughs> you left a crocodile. Actually, that's a thought. If you depopulate the entire food chain by the same amount, <laughs> relatively speaking, mm -hmm. would much harm be done? <laughs> hmm. I suppose you might have to also burn a, a certain amount of the vegetation. Mm-hmm. Cole's doing this very precisely. 
the he knows what he's doing. Last there. night I saw these yeah. creatures with my own eyes. They came Jerry's from the savannah children. like shadows in the dark. Before I could fire, I heard a strange whistling sound, and the beasts fled as one. <laughs> Damn it, Jerry! The villagers are right. Evil forces are at work here. Stop playing the recorder. Nobody c cares that you can play Hot Cross Bun on that. Hot Cross Buns. There's more than one bun in that song. Oh, I'll show you some. Anyway. <laughs> oh, I thought that rock was a sleeping lion for a second. Uh, he turned into a rock because he knew he was already dead. <gasps> You're dead, lion! Becky... I am Becky. Becky. Oh, it's some Becky. Hi. Hey, kill him. Oh. The villagers are burning the savannah. They believe that the attacks on their families are the work of a demon, the Kaftar. They say the Kaftar is a shapeshifter, half man, half beast, like a werewolf, only much worse. The people are mad with fear. They burn the savannah to purge the Kaftar's evil. I see in your eyes you do not believe in such things as demons. But I ask you, what animal kills for pleasure? Even the famous lions of Savo were driven to kill by hunger, but these beasts leave the bodies of the dead where they fall. The villagers have tried traps, poison, all useless. Perhaps the creatures we hunt are not animals at all. I ask you, what is more frightening? The thought of a beast with the mind of a man, or a man with the soul of a beast? The wound is not clean. I will need antibiotics to stop the infection. There is a petrol facility not far from here, but I cannot walk. I fear I will die here. <clears throat> you are a good man, called Rinsford. You remind me of a man I once knew, a good friend. I pray that you will not meet the same fate he did. What I'm trying to say is, your dad is a ghost. <laughs> no! Your, da your dad is a weird ghost. <laughs> I'm sorry, my African-Russian friend. What <laughs> voice are you doing? I don't know. <laughs> Look, seriously, your leg is fine. Dude? Oh no, my pants. <laughs> my pants! Uh, uh, fire textures. Okay, let's go find a vehicle or something. Also, I like when you fall down a ledge, you just kind of gently float down it like you're a leaf. The stealthiest hunters of all of Africa. Mm hmm. Shot that thing's heart so hard the game froze for a second. It was in awe of your mastery. Mm hmm. Yeah, you gotta make eye contact with the skulls. You stare them down, and they know you're their master. Yes. We'll protect you from my brethren. There's really not much you can protect a skull from. They're already dead. Yeah. Oh, there you are. Hey! High five, buddy! <laughs> See ya! <laughs> Here, have my skull. I heard men talking earlier. Butchers using the fires to cover their tracks. They must have a truck. Find it cool. We'll never escape here on foot. They were drunk as hell. If you could find some antibiotics in the truck, <laughs> that would be nice, Skull. <laughs> no, you've used them for yourself. Call you rat bastard. <laughs> it's okay, I'll take your skull when you're dead. We will become as one, Mbeki. 
That doesn't count as a headshot. But that's a hard shot, though. Shoot him in the butt. It, it has good penetration. Mm -hmm. Oh, there's a skull! You see it? Ah, oh, okay. Yeah. Just gets stuck on you. It's trying to force its way into a pocket, but, you know... Get out of the truck! The poachers are dead! They ate the poachers! Oh my god. What? And you're next! No. I am stronger than one man. The thing is, the poachers hadn't been hunting for all those horns and, and journals and things. They, they aren't nearly leveled up enough. Mm. Guess what? Exciting car chase rail shooter. Yes. Next time. The hunters have become the hunted. Oh, again. Oh, God. Again. No, not again.